On the road to pursuing God, there is a path that splits into two parts. One of those paths is relationship, while the other path is religion. As a person walks on the path of relationship with God, that person is conformed into the image of Jesus. And the longer they walk on that path, the more they are conformed into His image and likeness. But as a person walks on the path of religion, they begin to conform God into their image. And the longer they're on this path, the more the image of Jesus looks like them. Over the centuries, people have conformed the image of Jesus into many different horrible contorted icons, such as Pope Jesus. That's the Jesus that enforces Roman papal supremacy. Emperor Jesus. That's the Jesus that turns citizens of a country into subjects and servants for the monarchy. Plantation Jesus. That's the Jesus that says it's okay to enslave your neighbor. Liberation Theology Jesus. That's the Jesus that helps you overthrow governments and turns them into Marxist socialist paradises. Psychedelic Jesus. That's the Jesus that allows you to experiment with every type of mind-altering drug. And now, Woke Jesus. The Jesus that is okay with your sexual experimentation and gender fluidity. Do whatever your lust desire. And beware, sometime in the future, there will be Mufti Jesus. That's the Jesus that comes back to help the Muslims drive the Jews out of the land of Israel. That's one contorted image you do not want to follow. Religious people need to stop contorting the image of Jesus into their own likeness. He doesn't conform to our image. We need to conform to his.